It was a cool but sun splash day when I went to the Amp at 16 Tech to talk to people about the weather. What I found were a lot of smart, cheerful folks undaunted by this spring's dramatic swings in temperature. Well, it's Indiana. You don't like it. Wait a couple minutes and it's going to change. Yeah, I love the warm weather we had over the weekend and the rain's been making the garden look pretty and I love snow, so I feel like I'm all set. You're, you're in heaven in Indiana. Perfect. Yep. Over at Fresh Catch, Mike Hiblin was smiling despite being bewildered. I mean, we've been all over the place. Freezing one day and the next day or two days later it's 80 degrees. So, and I was out riding my bike. Uh, you can see I got a sunburn from uh, on Saturday and I said Monday morning I woke up and it was two inches of snow. So. Corey Cathcart was working on the latest edition of Pattern Magazine, cheerfully unaffected by hot or cold winds. Sometimes I call it full spring because it's like nice, but it's not really nice the next day. But it's kind of a rejuvenating feeling. It's like rain, shine, rain, shine. And I think it seems like it's good for the plants. So and it usually smells good when it rains. I like the variation. Her Pattern Magazine teammate, Alexa Carr, prefers the warmth. I was so happy that it was so warm. I'm always such so happy whenever it's warm outside. It was like, it's always like, like crazy to see that the change, but I'm always so happy. Lindsay Johnson views this wacky weather philosophically. I love the spring. I get this like sensation when the springtime is hitting. Um, it almost feels like the world is opening up, if that makes sense. Um, the mood, your mood is better. Um, and so I was really feeling that when it, you know, hit the 70s, 80s. Um, but then I started kind of feeling bad because I, it also messes with my sinuses. So. The fact that it went back down, I kind of am relieved, but I, I'm not a fan of the cold. So anytime it wants to get back up, that's fine with me. So the general consensus here at AMP is that yes, we all want it to warm up and stay warm. That goes double for the ladies I spoke to who are getting ready to open up an ice cream joint. Lori Kinsey and Victoria Beatty are upbeat about opening Scoops ice cream at the AMP. I just think you better keep a jacket in the car. You never know. One day it's 80, the next day it's 40. And you're getting ready to open up an ice cream joint, so you want it to warm up, right? Absolutely. We're opening Scoops Ice Cream down at the 16 Tech Amp Building. Come see us when it's a little warmer. Scoops will be open soon down here at the Amp. We're hoping before the summer, of course, so everyone can come down when it's really warm to grab a scoop of ice cream. As we all await sustained warmth to justify frozen scoops of ice cream, we will keep our core warm, our pilot light burning.